ओके दिस क्यूरीज आर फाइनली हेयर हाय गाइस इफ यू समवन हु वांट्स टू रिसीव अ लॉट ऑफ कॉम्प्लीमेंट्स दिस स्प्रिंग एंड समर यू वांट टू शाइन थ्रू यू वांट टू बी दैट पिंटरेस्टी गर्ल वेल यू आर द परफेक्ट प्लेस माय फ्रेंड बिकॉज़ आई एम गोना टू बी शेयरिंग विद यू ऑल सम ऑफ द मोस्ट पॉपुलर स्प्रिंग स्लैश समर ट्रेंड्स ऑफ 2024 सो विदाउट एनी फर्दर डिले लेट्स बिगिन the first trend that i feel like is going to be real real big is white color white is going to stand out and it's not just going to be like white white it's going to be textures of white different fabrics of white for example if you see sabhe sachi's collection it is all white this season which means that white is something that is definitely going to shine through even at the ambani's pre wedding festivities literally most of the people were wearing white so white is going to be the color you can wear white maxi dresses white poplin dresses sleeveless dress shirt dress anything that is white but has texture to it if you want to add like an indian wear touch to it maybe you can do a different type of drape of your dupatta or add some embellishments here and there i feel like white is such a beautiful color in general as well i feel like it screams summer other than the usual pop of colors i feel like white is definitely something that stands the next out. trend on our list is definitely something that we all wear in summers it's sheer mesh or chiffon fabrics or tops now i feel like this is such a great great trend for the season because in summers we of course feel the heat we need to beat the heat and for that this is a perfect perfect option i feel like mesh is something that looks really really beautiful and especially it totally depends on how you style it if i want a party look for example i'll add some rhinestone earrings or maybe a mesh that is more party like beat of silver color or be it in the form of the way it has some glitter particles on it so basically totally depends on what type of outfit what type of occasion you are looking for but this fabric is definitely something that's going to be big this summer so i feel like we should definitely hop on this trend and be a girls girly when we're talking about fabrics let's all talk about open air or crochet tops that is also going to be in this summer i feel like this has always been a trend in summers because when i love wearing these kind of fabrics they are so airy and they definitely help you in beating the heat i actually really really like wearing this kind of fabrics if you guys remember i even showed it to you guys in one of my urbanic hauls have this blue and green gradient sort of top and i feel like you can also purchase this kind of gradient tops they also look equally good you can either purchase the basic one or add a color block so totally depends on how you want to style it but open air and crochet tops are definitely in you can pair it up with a spaghetti underneath a tank top underneath or you can basically wear it over something it looks good either way. i really like another trend that is going to be in this summer and spring is going to be striped shirts and not just a regular striped shirt it's going to be a pop of color striped shirts now i love stripes i don't know why but i even talked about it in one of my body type videos it definitely gives an illusion of accentuating your body type somehow and i actually really really like it so i feel wearing colorful stripes definitely adds a lot of summer vibe to it just imagine whenever you think of spring or summer we always think of colors we always think of pinks and yellows and blues so when you will wear colorful stripes it will definitely add that summer vibe to it just make sure that whatever you wearing that is striped always make sure that it's colorful another color that is going to be real real trendy is ice blue i really like this color we can even call it powder blue somehow but i love this color and what i love even more about it is that in the fashion week they've styled it in so many different aesthetics whenever we think about ice blue we always think about the soft girl aesthetic as you can see but it's not soft girl at all it's not restricted to that you can even create a baddie look with the same ice blue and it can be styled in so many different fabrics and so many different ways you can maybe wear an ice blue top along with black you can wear an ice blue skirt along with some other color top so it's not like it's restricted to just one particular type it can be worn in so many different ways if 
if you don't like to carry it as a top or bottom wear you can even carry like an ice blue bag with your outfit it would look so gorge but the main thing here is that ice blue is going to be very very trendy and i love ice blue with all my heart it's such a calm and subtle color yet makes such a good statement. next trend on our list is going to be pencil skirt now pencil skirts are something that's such a classic we've been wearing them for ages now and they're finally back in trend now what's more to it is that you just not have to wear a normal pencil skirt another trend that's associating with it is that you can pair it up with rhinestones or embellishments i feel like rhinestones and embellishments are going to be really big especially throughout 2024 not just spring and summer and when you wear something that has a lot of embellishments to it that definitely adds more to that particular fabric and that is why pencil skirts are not just to be worn very simply like we do so it doesn't have to be plain necessarily you can maybe play a little bit with its texture or its fabric or even add a little bit of such embellish Embellishments to make a statement. Another thing that's really trending these days is bows. Well, is it visible? Yeah, it is now. You guys know how much I am obsessed with soft girl aesthetic. You can clearly see, and I love bows with all my heart. And if you guys know, you must be aware of it now. Bows are the trend, you all. Bows are gonna stay forever. I love this trend. I feel like this brings out the girly side of you, which is something that I really, really like. So even if you're not a soft girl, or even if you don't like this, you can give it a try. Trust me, you would look gorgeous. Even Deepika Padukone hopped on this trend, and I really love her look. Even Ari, I saw her yesterday. By Ari, I mean Ariana. But Ari was looking so gorgeous. She was wearing this black dress along with bow, and she looked so gorgeous. Another trend that I really like is metallics. Metallics are in. Now you might be like Sneha. Metallics don't really suit for summer or spring. Well, well, well. There is always a way to hop on trends. I feel like when it comes to metallics, it totally depends on how you want to style it. I have a secret. I actually purchased something that's metallic. I'm going to be sharing it with you all most probably in the next video, which is going to be. But 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 I'm going to be sharing that with you all, and I will tell you how to style it. But majorly, totally depends on what kind of fabric are you looking for and what you want to style it with. So usually, if you like to take it all out, I would suggest you guys to actually buy a metallic pair of pants and pair it up with maybe a white shirt or something. And if you like to keep it more minimal, I feel like. A metallic top would do. So totally depends on how you want to style it. Even metallic dresses are in these days, and they look so pretty. So if you have a party coming up, if your birthday is coming up, I feel like that would be a perfect top. Pop of colors. Oh my god, I've talked about it in my 2024 fashion trends video as well. But pop of color is really in these days, especially the color blue. As I talked about it before, blue in general is the one that is going to be on trend. As you can see, I'm actually wearing a blue liner. I'm not sure if it looks black on the camera, but I'm actually wearing a blue liner today, and it looks so pretty IRL. I feel like blue is going to be the color of the season. Your pop of color could be just by anything. Maybe a pink liner, a blue liner. It could be a popping nail paint. Anything basically. a pop of color is something that we are looking for it could be just by some embellishment on your dress we want to add something that further adds to your outfit a lot of times you know we are wearing a particular outfit and it looks very bland honestly it doesn't look like anything so if you want to add something to your execution of the outfit to make it stand out i feel like this trend is definitely something you should hop on especially not only in terms of outfits in terms of makeup as well just adding a little bit of pop of color definitely makes a difference it could be by wearing colorful outfits or even playing with our makeup but pop of color is definitely in and if you're soft girl like me well hairs more This year, I feel like it's going to be more so soft girl year because we have some more girl core trends. Another trend that's really going on is lace, and along with lace, another one is going to be fringes. So any form of lace in your outfit, any form of fringes in your outfit is definitely something that's going to stand out. And another big trend is roses. Well, I love this trend. Floral outfits are coming back as you can see I'm actually wearing a floral outfit 
and floral outfits are definitely something that we all look up to whenever it comes to summers because they definitely channelize that summer vibe and floral is definitely something that's going to be big in summers or spring i feel like it could be just a normal outfit or you could even add like uh, that rose choker that's going on it looks so pretty just anything floral or rosy is definitely something that's going to stand out i saw someone in the fashion week wearing like a rose shaped bag or even a rose shaped dress it looks so pretty it totally depends on how you want to style it well mob wife i don't know if you guys know about it but it's a trend on instagram i feel like it's no longer a trend but it was a trend on instagram like a lot of people recreated like a mob wife look now mob wife was all about a black smoky kind of look and a very classy look well that is what is coming in fashion as well so mob wife basically refers to animal prints now you would be like sneha summer and spring with animal prints well yes was that rhyming but anyways yes animal prints are going to be in summer and spring i recently saw sara ali khan wearing like an animal print kind of dress it looks so pretty you can style this trend by even wearing a bodycon dress and you would look gorgeous Short shorts are coming back shorts are a classic for summers and spring but this time we are even going shorter it's called short shorts so it's a shorter version of shorts where i feel like summers are all for you going all out with your fashion and this is definitely something that you should give a try someone who doesn't like to do a lot with fashion if you follow clean girl aesthetic i feel like this trend is for you so there is a trend which is known as elevated casual which what you have to do is you have to wear your casuals properly i've created a lot of videos around this i'll make sure i'll leave some of them in the description box below these videos basically revolve around the fact that how you can elevate your basic outfits and that is what i talk about in each and every haul and each and every fashion video so make sure that you are subscribed for that but it basically talks about the fact that pick up pieces that are basically a part of your capsule wardrobe or the pieces that everyone has be it a tank top or a t-shirt white t-shirt denim jeans and for the style it in different ways to make it more elevated it could be by layering it could be by right type of accessories it could be by making a sleek bun basically the right way of styling it such that you add more to it if you guys know there is a trend which is called wearing versus styling and i feel like this is a perfect example of that just wearing it would be basic but styling it accurately would be elevated basic and another color that is definitely going to stand out is bold red so this summer bold red is definitely something that's going to be a part of our styling but in terms of color blocking if you are someone who likes to play with colors at the same time wants to add a little bit to your outfits i feel like red is something that you can definitely look forward to in 2023 if you guys remember cherry red was the color and in 2024 i feel like we're carrying it forward but in a more subtle way in terms of color blocking and not just the color entirely and yes finally something that we hate and love like a love hate relationship belts are back but not just regular belts you know statement belts are back if you guys know how much of a difference belts can make oh my god you guys if you have a good statement belt that can definitely cinch your entire look together and further make it look so much more beautiful and gorgeous so i feel like statement belts is something that you should invest in and not just hop on the trend it could be in terms of maybe a belt that has a cool buckle or a belt that has rhinestones on it that could also be a good option so basically invest in good embellished or statement belt and the last trend that i'm going to talk about is polo necks well polo necks is definitely going to be 2024 trend i've talked about it in my 2024 fashion trends video polo necks is something that is going to be a part of 2024 and i love polo necks i feel like that entire polo neck situation adds a lot to your outfit and i get a lot of compliments every time i wear a polo neck so i feel like this is definitely something that you can look forward to and polo neck is something that can be styled in so many different aesthetics it could be like a clean girl aesthetic it could be an elevated casual aesthetic it could also be a soft girl aesthetic if styled correctly so polo neck is definitely something that's making a comeback and yeah that was all about my rapid fireish spring summer trend video i really hope you guys liked it 
do let me know in the comment section if you want me to tell you guys what kind of wardrobe essentials you need for this kind of trends and further how to style them i'll definitely help you with that as well if you like this video don't forget to press the like button and also subscribe to the channel if you're new because we're going to be talking a lot about summer and spring in the upcoming videos and stay safe stay happy stay gorgeous stay amazing try to hop on these trends as much as possible but keep your authentic self add your own creative juices to them and i'll see you guys next time take care goodbye